G'day world and welcome back to Stuff We Do, where we do all the knife stuff you love. Knife reviews, knife tests, knife modifications and outdoor stuff with knives. Okay, today is Friday. Um, tough week, short week, but horrible. But we made it, so that's great. <clears throat> this weekend, um, I want to show you a few videos. Okay, I got back home about an hour or so ago. But I want to show you a few things this weekend, um, random things. Yeah, I will throw a few knives in there and a knife modification or what I did. I didn't actually video me changing the thing, but just what it looks like and stuff like that. But today I want to talk about something else. <coughs> Excuse me. For, oh, and we'll do that machete modification that I was telling you about because the stuff I was waiting for is in here. Okay, so... Um, uh, few weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago, I decided I've never ordered anything from Timu, Temu, whatever you want to call this stuff, I'm going to order from them. Um, yeah, I didn't really speak to people about it, but later on, yeah, everybody told me it's like Wish, kind of. Anyway, so I ordered from them. First thing, I ordered the stuff I wanted. It was like 16 Rand, but... When I saw it on a different site, take a lot, it was 210 Rand. <clears throat> so I decided, okay, I'm going to take this chance. Pay my 16 Rand. But I decided, okay, if it's so cheap, I'm going to take two rolls of this tape. Because it's tape that I saw Gary from the Last Ranger use. Anyway, so I decided, okay, I'm going to take the chance, I'm going to get this stuff. Then, when I wanted to check out, they said, no, you cannot submit it yet you have to spend at least 200 rand. And I said, okay, that sounds kind of fair. It's all right. So I bought lots of weird little things that looked interesting. Okay, so we are at 201 rand and I bought this stuff. A few days later, I get weird automated phone calls and I get messages that I have to pay Buffalo International for um, duty fees, taxes, and shipping or something like that. No, no, shipping is free with Temu. But duty or taxes or something. So I have to pay them an extra 60 rand. So now we're at 260 rand for something I could have bought immediately for a few rand less. Okay, fair enough. Not all of the little thingy keys, but you get what I'm saying. If I really wanted the stuff, I could have just bought it and yeah, I had it, whatnot. Anyway, then in the shipping bill or the the... What do you call that thing? Anyway, the list of stuff that was shipped to me um, by Buffalo International. Um, I think that's the name. Uh, they gave the things these weird names. And I started worrying because I th yeah, I was not sure what I was going to get at that, st that stage. But anyway, it arrived. And I must say, everything that came here was pretty much what I expected. So that makes me very happy. So let me just quickly show you what I got at my haul from Timu. Now, this thing I already started using. It's one of those 100% cotton bandanas. I got two rolls of these things. What does it say? I don't know what it says. I have no idea. Of course, everything's going to be made in China. But anyway, I got two rolls of these things. It's not sticky when you touch it. But when it sticks on itself, it sticks. Okay, so it's that self-adhesive tape to wrap things with. Okay, so I got two rolls of that. That's actually what we were waiting for. Then, oh, another bandana. This one is just uh, green. This is also apparently 100% cotton bandana. So we have two of those guys. Those two things. What was in here? Oh, it was the other bandana that was in there. What was in here? Oh, the tape I opened. Oh, here I only have the little thingy key. I'll explain to you now. Where's the other one? Okay, I got two of these things. Now, it's difficult to find these things in South Africa, but you can get them on Timu. Anyway, it's these easy opening clips, okay, that you put on a knife, you put a little screw in, and then you have like a thumb stud on a slip joint. Now, I already installed this one on a knife that I will show you in a little bit, but these things are actually quite awesome, and I need more of these easy openers. Okay, and then this stuff, that's for later. Now, this stuff they called... 
Okay, it doesn't say on it. But this stuff is like um, waxed, um, waxed twine or something like that. It's like a jute or something, but it's a wax thing. So we will see how that works. So, okay, there we go. My weird little shopping trip, or not shopping trip, but shopping thing from Timu. Okay, that's me. All of you, stay safe, happy, have a good one. So you can buy from them, Brer, that the taxes or the importing is going to go up a lot. So, yeah, just check. And it took forever. No, not forever. It took like two and a half weeks, three weeks. I actually imported things straight from China previously. And it was here way quicker. So I don't know. Anyway, all of you, stay safe, happy. Have a good one. Goodbye.